Y'all, I wrote this book. It is called Get Out of Your Own Way, A Skeptic's Guide to Growth and Fulfillment. That's a good title though. Listen, my attempt here was to take, in the same way that Rachel did with Grow Wash Your Face, the 20 times where I got in my own way, where I made choices or showed up in a way that was not the best representation of who I hope to be in life, and how I learned something and applied that learning to stay out of my own way. But here's the thing, I didn't just write another version of Girl Wash Your Face, I wrote a book from my perspective, that of someone who is not motivated, like motivation unicorn Rachel Hollis. In this intro, we have just debunked the very first lie of the book, and that is the lie that self-help is for broken people. Self-help is not for broken people. Trying to make yourself better, it's for everyone, anyone. The tie between growth and fulfillment, it is the strongest tie in the universe. If you are not growing, you will not be fulfilled. So if you think that self-help in some way indicts you for not being good enough already, you're wrong. Self-help is for people who want to grow. People who want to grow are going to be fulfilled. Get on the fulfillment bus, y'all. Get this book. Let's go. Let's go.